All right, hello everyone, and welcome back to my Crusader Kings 2 series, where today we are, of course, still playing as the Principality of Amalfi with our now 63-year-old Grand Prince Rogood of Amalfi. And today we got a couple of things I want to take care of, but more importantly, I want to be slightly flabbergasted at the beginning of this video as to the state of Europe at the moment. Oh my freaking god, how has Europe become what it is? First and foremost, we have Poland, who started out as just a couple of counties over here originally. It then took over Denmark, which already right there confused the ever-living crap out of me. And now, it's gone up north through the Scandinavian Peninsula. How in the crap has Poland gone this far north through the Scandinavian Peninsula. I don't... I don't understand. But yes, Poland has indeed continued to move northward, which is very, very weird. I also find it amusing that Iceland over here is split between uh, Norgia and Island as two independent counties, and that... That makes me amused. I kind of want to conquer them just for the shits and giggles of it, but we'll uh, we'll have to hold off on that for a little bit, I'd think. Now, as for other potential threats as such, uh, remember a couple of episodes ago, I think it was, I was kind of beginning to get worried about how big Brittany was getting. Yeah, that's not the case anymore. Uh, basically, all Brittany has at the moment is these couple of counties in the Holy Roman Empire. That is it. As you'll notice, their stuff in Spain over here is currently in a rebellion. So Brittany is kind of getting torn apart right now. And if you'll notice in France, Brittany is now Granada. How in the hell did Granada get this? That must have been a masterful marriage plan of some form, because seriously, how in the crap is Granada in France? <laughs> I love it. I love it. Oh, it's always so wonderful what these grand strategy games will do to history. Plus, England is still just a complete mess up here. Look at all this stuff. There's things everywhere. I'm surprised Scotland actually hasn't gotten their act together and conquered more of it. But oh well, what are you gonna do? Now, as for our country, immediate things I want to take. Of course, I do want to finish up getting the toe of the boot of Italy. I think it'd be quite nice, but that'll have to wait until they rebel at some point for me to actually grab that. My immediate target is going to be this fella right here in Zagreb, since he was foolish enough to make a pact against me, and then immediately leave that pact after like an episode. So um, yeah, he's my next target. In fact, I kind of feel like insulting him and requesting his excommunication. I kind of want to do that purely for the sake of screw you, buddy, and the fact that I control the papacy and I haven't used this tool yet. We're gonna do it. Let's request excommunication right here, right now. And it's a maybe, which means yes, because we control the freaking Pope. He is our vassal, so boom. We're gonna do that, that should be fun. Uh, again, there's no real reason for me to do that. I just want to, because I think it'll insult him and his family, and he deserves it, because he shouldn't have joined the defensive pact against me, frankly. He should have just accepted the offer of vassalization that I sent him like two episodes ago. That would have been good, but no, but no. Now, as for future plans of where I want to go, I want to take these islands. I want to take these at some point. Now, it's a entire duchy right here, so that's what I want to shoot for, is eventually we will make a claim on this duchy titles to take these two sets of islands, or two counties, rather, and I think it would be quite good. That is just those two, right? So, du jour counties, yes, yes, it's just those two things there, the, uh... Mallorca, so that should be quite good if we do get that, because, well, frankly, I want to control the Mediterranean. I, 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 I want this too. <laughs> Basically, I want the Mediterranean. That is my ultimate goal in the future. We'll see how far we can actually get in that, but uh, you know what? For the time being, what we're going to do is I'm going to take the suggestion of some of you lovely commenters 
And uh, actually, no, wrong tab. I always do that every time. I go into intrigue when I mean military and vice versa. But we are going to actually build up our retinue more because we do make so much freaking money. I can easily afford a much bigger retinue to provide us with more military power. And one thing I did notice, my current character here is actually Italian culture, which our previous Grand Mayor or Grand Prince rather was not. He was still Lombard, but we are indeed Italian. So we can go and get these custom Italian pikemen. And so we're just gonna go and get that, these special units. So let us click to build up a unit of you. Oh no, that didn't, oh my God, that just built them. Oh, I thought that I was in the good for having a special unit. I guess I'm not. I guess I'm not. So yes, that did just add in more people to the, our general pikemen there. Huh, interesting. You guys told me if I went, if I was Italian, I could get special Italian pikemen. I've never been Italian before, so I, I, I honestly don't know how that goes with the special soldiers. But yeah, that's, um... Interesting. I wonder if maybe we have to do something with our country as a whole. I mean, Amalfi, our capital, is Italian. Our leader, Italian. Interesting. I guess maybe perhaps we actually have to form the Italian Empire, maybe, to actually get the specialized units for it. That would make sense. That would indeed actually make sense. But for now, oh well. We just built ourselves some additional pikemen, which isn't too bad. And in fact... I may build some more. Hmm, so that was 400 pikemen we just did there. Eh, maybe more cavalry? Hmm. I'm not, I'm not entirely sure. How's my technology? Light infantry and heavy infantry both have positive three on their skills. So maybe I go with something that is a, a good combination of those two. Except, of course, it doesn't. We can either choose light infantry and archers or heavy infantry and archers. Interesting. Okay, fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. Uh, Let's go with this one, then. Heavy infantry up here with some archers. Boom, we'll get that. So we'll have even more glorious, glorious military forces in our retinue. Which shouldn't be costing us too much more once we have that all built up and should be quite nice and be a little bit better than having to constantly buy all sorts of, uh, oh god, what's the word? Mercenaries. There we go. Mercenaries. Beautiful. Okay, so let's unpause and actually take a sip of my drink here. Perfect. And what do we have here? Oh, God. Um, the vile excess of Duke Philippe. Oh, beautiful. We did excommunicate him. <laughs> oh, it makes me so happy. Okay, we have excommunicated him. Perfect. Ooh, actually, now that he's excommunicated... Hmm. Can we... <laughs> yes, this is what I was hoping for. If we excommunicated him, I was hoping maybe we could invade his country for him being excommunicated. And we can click. <laughs> yeah. Oh, does he have friends? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. He does. Oh, oh God. King of Leon, you say? Oh, my. That's actually an impressive ally you have. Holy crap. How do you have that ally? Seriously, you're a tiny little one county miner. I, I literally do not understand this, but you know what? We're going to attack him anyways because meh to him. Actually, <laughs> hmm. let's hold off. Let's hold off. Let's let my retinue build up more and then we'll just move our retinue to Veglia. And then immediately when we declare war, just move right into his territory. So we'll hold off on attacking him for the time being. Uh, Marshal, blah, 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 hard work, and everyone seems to like him. I'm deciding between having my Marshal heighten the morale of the troops or recruit more people. Recruit. Boom. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. I think that's a good way to go. Oh, 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 we just had a dangerous faction come and go. 
Well, now I'm intrigued. Hold on, factions. Oh, yes. Of course. My kinsmen wanting independence. And yet again, Toronto wanting council power increase in Amalfi. Oh my god, I forgot I was trying to kill someone. Wait, who am I trying to kill? Also, I find it hilarious that the Pope is helping me try to kill this person. Oh, it's Lord Mayor Ladari. Isn't that him? Yes. Yes, it is him. <laughs> yes. Well, he's going to die momentarily by the Pope's hand. And that's great. Look out below. Let's see how this goes. Don't fail me now, Pope. We have God on our side. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's going to be great. Some inheritance things going on there. Ah, uh, he discovered the sabotage. Oh, boy. But he doesn't know who to blame. Fair enough, fair enough. Damn it, Pope. Come on, man. Come on. You're supposed to be... You're supposed to be on my side here. Not messing around with things. Huh? Oh, God. Oh! 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 We died. Huh. Okay, okay. Well, fair enough. Fair enough. We have died. But that means we can actually move into our plans. Wait, what? <laughs> Apparently, my character got patient just before he died. Wow. Wow. Okay, well, let's click that and remain paused. So we have... Tidalosh on succession for the time being, because yes, we aren't going to win the election at the moment. Who is our heir? He is crap. He is crap. Oh, God, who is my current person? 45. That is a fancy hat you have. I like it. I like it. So who do we want to actually have as our potential future Grand Prince, because now now that we have died and gone through an official succession, I'm going to try to designate an heir again. This was our plan, so let's see how this goes. You... Ooh, actually, you're not bad. You have a territory already in Lucera. Oh, no, I, I decided I wanted to be someone... Uh, I decided I wanted to have it as someone who didn't have a territory already. Mm hmm. Oh God, I didn't expect to have to look for a new heir this episode. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. Okay. Let's look through these guys. No, they're still children. That might be something, though. We may just have to wait, maybe an episode or two to have. Because yeah, I may have to look for whoever it is off camera. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that. But for the time being. Let us pop into the campaign fund. <laughs> uh, we'll just put a thousand in there and that'll be more than enough to uh, serve us for quite some time. Yeah, we'll just even it off to a thousand there. Perfect, perfect. So even if things do go horribly, horribly wrong for us, we have a safety net and that is a good thing. Now, unfortunately, we did just die, which means, oh God, council, they're all still doing their thing. Perfect, that's good. Laws, meh, tech, ugh, legalism. We just need one more point in legalism. Ooh, character. I'm going to do stewardship. Because I need, I need the boost for my dimensions. size. Alright, let's go for that. You... Ambitious, arbitrary, zealous, gregarious, greedy, and indulgent wastrel. You, great eminence, perfect. Lustful, perfect. Why aren't you having children then? Also, am I already leading an army right now? No, resign. Go, go get with your wife. Create more children. We have a daughter right now, which is a good thing. That is a very good thing. In fact, ooh, ooh, in fact. Hi, Holy Roman Empire. No, you've married. Oh, and your heir has only daughters. 
Can't exactly lesbian marry a daughter from my family into your family now, can I? Hmm. Darn you, medieval period. Oh my god, I can't believe we lost our, our next grand prince already. Jesus. Oh god, and now I have to find the next Mara who I do want to control territory. You had your chance, so, a person of Salerno. But you screwed yourself. You screwed yourself. Uh, at least we still got the Pope. Now, what was I doing? Oh, yes, we were building up our arm. Oh, we're not trying to kill that guy anymore. Well, we can remedy that situation. Bought to kill. <laughs> there we go. Perfect. Auto invite. So we were going to go to war with him. Do we still have the same? <gasps> we don't. Oh, my God. Did he get back into the Catholic Church? That son of a bitch. Okay, okay, so we're going to have to actually plan this out a bit better. We're going to have to get our military in place once our retinue is fully developed. And then move it up there. Yeah, it's going to take a while for our retinue to get fully developed. Let's unpause things. Dangerous factions, of course, you bastards. You! Do I have a thing? No, you, what are you? Ambition. No, we don't have an ambition. Groom and heir. There we go. It's the only thing I have available. Lovely. Yeah, the dangerous factions. You, I'm just going to kill. You, I'm going to have to deal with at some point. Damn it, Spoleto. Seriously, you think your three counties can deal with the magnificence that is the Empire of Amalfi? Or, well, rather, the Principality of Amalfi, but, you know, same old, same old. Oh, I gotta marry my daughter off to someone. Oh, boy, hello, things are happening. Someone's trying to kill someone. What is this? Oh, my God, we already have a co-conspirator, my uh, a kinswoman of Benevento, trying to... Wait, what is this? A pit of manure has been prepared under the floorboards of an abandoned inn on a path Lord Mayor Ladari will travel with his escort. I don't think I've seen this one. My god, kaboom. Also, why am I wanting to um imprison this person? I don't know. Oh, they were trying to kill someone. But who? Own pots. Wait, is he wait, hold on, what? Hold, 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 hold a moment, hold a moment. Is he trying to kill his wife? Seeks. Yeah. Oh my god, he's trying to kill his wife. How dare you, sir? How dare you try to kill your wife? Do what everyone else does and conquer the papacy and then just request a divorce. That is clearly the way to go. I'm kind of tempted to imprison him. He is the Policario's family, which is a rival. My top rival, in fact. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, screw it. We're imprisoning him. <laughs> oh, God, he was one of my counselors. Uh, oh, he was chancellor. Oh, I screwed that up. <laughs> okay. Okay. What was your what was your rating with that? Hmm. Okay, I've already forgotten which one chancellor was. That one. Oh, 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 well, I've also in, yeah, in dungeon negative 10. So you had 12. You had 12. Hmm. Hmm. So, yeah, these guys aren't exactly better, but, I mean, they aren't worse either. There we go. The Musco family gets it now. 
Oh, I'm putting you in the oubliette. Yeah, that's happening. Screw you. Okay, well, let's wait for this kaboom thing to happen. Hopefully it goes better than our plan with the Pope last time. Oh, it helped on pause. There we go. There we go. Wait for it. Wait for it. I'm still waiting. <laughs> uh, how hard is it to kill someone with a manure pit? Come on, people. Hey! <laughs> we did it, guys. We did it. He perished in a manure explosion. <laughs> wow, that's impressive. Yeah, I don't know if I've ever had that one before. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Well, he went out with a bang, so boom, he's dead now. Which means this faction... Oh, oh. The Pope now wants to increase council power. Dude. Dude. You're the Pope. Why are you why are you getting in on the That's actually slightly worrisome. He has a lot of territory at the moment. That is actually a very, very worrisome thing to have the Pope currently as one of these factions. Um oh do you 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 oh um Ha! Ah. Yeah, send him a gift. <laughs> it's really the only thing I can think of doing at the moment. What other options do we have? Do we have any fun ones? No, we really don't. What would he take as a gift? A big gift! Ha! <laughs> nope. 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 Alright, fine. Fine. Oh my god, and one of my kin has already gone for it. Veglia, Veglia. You bitch. Wait, why don't you like me? Demand's too big, yeah, okay. D Duchy too big, yeah, okay. Wrong type of government, yeah, okay. Foreigner? Wait, wait what? Foreign? Oh, he's Greek. He's Greek. How are you Greek? <laughs> I... Hmm. Interesting. Well, let's see. Can we do anything for him? Are you cheaper to buy off with a gift? You are. Perfect. Let's unpause for a moment. Well, he likes me now. I'd like to form an alliance with him or something, or a non-aggression pact. But that doesn't seem to be a thing that we can do. Oh, hello! Oh my god, now the Orso family we can imprison. Because he seeks to kill someone else. Eh, I'm going to hold off on that for the time being. I'm going to hold off on that. You bitch. How dare you. Oh god, how's my, how's my retinue going? Yeah, still a lot of people we got to get in there. All right, I can still arrest him. Intriguing. Do you... Yeah, he's still got that packed. Which of your kids is married? Nope. Nope. No. Wait, none of them are married. Or betrothed. How the crap does he have an alliance? What the hell? Oh, look, more have joined. You bitch, Apulia. Ugh. Sand. Yeah, you like me now. No more doing that, please. Don't make me retract your damn vassalage. I have a feeling that this is going to be a common occurrence for us now of these rebellions, which is not good for us. That is not good for us in the slightest. Oh, boy. 
Yeah, all we can do is transfer vassalage and things like that. We'd have to actually marry into her family to actually uh, get an alliance or anything. Hmm. Which is unfortunate. Or so are you the... You are. <laughs> I kind of want to arrest him too, purely because he... Well, you know what? No, he's no threat at all. Son was born to people. Good, good, good. Vassal is gained a cardinal seat. Good, perfect. Yes, close this, close this. Oh, oh god, I did not mean to click those buttons. Venice, I have actually been meaning to look at you for upgrades. Any fun things? You know, yeah, there we go. We got the cash for it. Okay. Well, I was hoping to in invade these guys this episode, but I don't think that's going to work out for us. Mainly because I was wanting to wait for my um, my retinue to fill up for that, but we've had to deal with other issues that have made that go more slowly. So yeah, we're waiting on a few more hundred soldiers at the moment. And you do! What the hell? Start having kids! Why are you not a oh boy? You're lustful! And a gray eminence. You sh two should be having kids left and right. But no. But no. Yeah, he doesn't have anything that does a negative to fertility. Thank God he's not chaste. He just, for some reason, does not seem to be wanting to have kids. So yeah, you're in Amalfi as well. Interesting. Hmm. Hmm. Do we have any? Oh my, oh dear lord, titles all over the place. Oh, hello. I have not checked this in a while. Hello, what are you? Oh good, you've converted an errant subject. Pause for a moment to hate me. You get a title. 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 No oh god, and four commander positions. Jesus. Uh, let's see. You'll get a title. Do that and actually try and find someone with some decent skill. You. What the hell, you? And there we go. So that's all those titles. Except for the designated heir, which I do need to find because that'll be a good thing. What the hell will make my... Whoa, hello. No, wait, let's actually just go straight to my wife and make her the designated regent. There we are. Lovely. She'll like me more. Hopefully that means we'll start having some kids. Good times. Let's unpause. And actually, I think this is a good place to stop the episode right here. We're at eh, 28 and a half minutes. Oh, hello. Oh, perfect. Another errant subject has been brought back into the Catholic faith. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Well, yeah, that is going to be it for this episode, though, folks. Uh, we're at basically the half hour mark. So a good point to end here. So I hope you all have enjoyed. Oh, hello. Oh, God, hello. Hey, tech. Beautiful. All right. So now let's pause. I hope you all have enjoyed this episode. And of course, they do come back for the next win. Hopefully, we will have the soldiers we need in purely our retinue to invade the Grebe without having to call up anyone else. And that'll be a good, good day once we excommunicate him. Oh, I love that plan. I love it so much. But that will be for the next episode. I hope you do come back for it. But until that time, thank you for watching. And as always, have a good one. Oh, go, oh, dear Lord. Also, something changed dram dramatically. Denmark came back. How the hell? Oh my god, look at it. Denmark like shotgunned the crap out of Poland. Denmark, 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 Denmark. Denmark there, Denmark there. They took back that. Holy crap, what happened to you, Poland? You used to be cool. All right, guys, well, that'll be it. Later, folks.